All right, hello YouTube, and welcome to another video. This one is a build overview for a landslide druid in Diablo 4. Now, the idea here is that you're basically like an earthbender. You get to use earth skills to demolish your enemies, and we have a couple um, bear skills as well, and we get to be bear pretty much all the time while we're in combat, which I'll get into later. And um, yeah, let's jump right into it. All right, first of all, the main skills we're going to be talking about uh, the main skill that's our spirit generator is Earth Spike. I'm actually going to open up the skills so we can just see them there. So I only put one point into Earth Spike. The other points are from um, items. So we just want to get spirit back with this skill. They can, it can stun. And also there's a second Earth Spike summoned when we hit an immobilized or stunned enemy, so basically doubles the damage. And it kind of hits an AOE, so if there's lots of enemies sitting next to each other, you kind of hit more than one, which is very nice. Um, and down here, this is Landslide. This is our bread and butter ability. This is going to be doing the, the bulk of our damage. As you can see, I have seven levels from item contribution, and I actually will get up to about level 16, I think, with, with all my procs up, which is incredible. And so what this does is it comes from each side and crushes enemies in between. So you just summon them and it goes crush. Um, and what this right, this next uh, slot will do is it will damage. Oh, so after it damages enemies four times, the next hit will immobilize them, which is great because with Terramote, I think that's this right here. Yeah, when you immobilize or stun an enemy, you gain a Terramote. So each enemy hit by landslide consumes a Terramote causing a guaranteed critical strike. Um, but it's only 40% critical strike damage. However, that is still amazing. It does a ton of damage. And bosses always have a chance to grant, a 10% chance to grant a Terramote when hit. So that means anytime I hit a boss, there's a 10% chance of getting a guaranteed critical strike, which is amazing on landslide. Uh, next, we have Earth and Bulwark. Oh, we have a kitty. She's jumped up and immediately bit on my cord. Here she is. A little Yumi break. Let's say hi to the camera. All right, um, this is our Unstoppable. Uh, and we also get Fortify from it. So this is, in case you're getting mobbed, you need to break out of a CC. This is very important to keep yourself safe. Uh, I don't use Debilitating Roar. Next, Poison Creeper. This ability, basically at all times, there's little vines. You can see them kind of around me. They'll just be hanging out and they'll attack enemies and poison them. It's It's okay. But what we're looking for here, it immobilizes them and increases by one second. So when you immobilize enemies, again, we are getting Terramotes. So when you immobilize enemies with this, every enemy you immobilize, you get a Terramote for Landslide to get a guaranteed critical hit. So you can immobilize them and then smack them with Landslide to get guaranteed critical hits. Also, we have a 20% increased critical strike chance against enemies strangled by Poison Creeper anyways. So you could even, if you're low on spirit, you can immobilize enemies and then get some spirit back and you're likely to have uh, an increased crit chance on them and then you can smash them with the guaranteed crit on landslide when you have enough spirit. Okay, and moving into our wrath skills. What we'll be using is hurricane and we're going to want to have this up off cooldown basically because when I go into the aspects, we're going to see that when this is up, we get plus two to all of my skills. And here we slow them, which is great. And we do deal more damage to enemies that are slowed based on our build. And we also will be making them vulnerable for three seconds for 15% chance. That's really good. So they're going to be taking even more damage. Um, and next, this is a really fun ability. And it's our only travel ability is trample. It becomes unstoppable. So you can use this to break CC, which is incredible. Uh, this is basically the core of our whole build, and it is our burst ability. Uh, we have an aspect that makes it so when we use Trample, we will be summoning six pillars of landslides. So I think it's something like 24 landslides are summoned or something crazy like that. Uh, and they just like, completely destroy all of the ground around where you're trampling, which is incredible. So Trample now does um, extra damage to the first enemy hit 150 percent bonus damage which is incredible and it grants you spirit which we need spirit for this build 
this the fortify version i guess if you really need to fortify you could do this but i mean the spirit is so good I and mean, you get fortify from other other ways as well i also i believe picked up some nodes in here i did this uh this increases the duration of hurricane endless tempest so it increases the duration that we have higher levels of wear bear skills here uh crushing earth we have increased damage to stun and mobilize and knock back enemies which we're always doing um critical strikes grant fortify which is incredible because we're always we've been we get guaranteed critical strikes so we're going to be fortifying ourselves and we also get bonuses for defense when we're fortified we get bonuses for damage when we're fortified based on our paragon points and build um and while we are fortified over 50 percent of our max life we get 12 percent increased damage to our earth skills this is amazing because it's really easy to get fortify up past this halfway point and suddenly we have 12 percent more damage so the longer we're fighting the more powerful we're going to be get becoming um, this defiance here, this is this is something I did with my um, reputation points. I put them in here just basically so I do more damage against elites. Um, and our capstone is Earth and Might. So this is a, this ability does so much damage. So you have a five percent chance on all of my Earth skills to restore your spirit and cause attacks to be guaranteed critical strikes. Amazing, um, and it's doubled. Four critical strikes, and if the target is stunned, the mobilizer knocked back, which is what we're doing all the time. So basically a 10% chance, almost flat out, for Earth and Might to activate, fill up your spirit, and be guaranteed critical strikes, which means we're probably going to want to trample them. But as you can see, we basically one-shot elites if we have trample up. Pretty much. And that blast is going to go off, but we're going to be over here on the other side, so we're going to be away from it. Okay, we have these two elites again. Boom, boom, one shot, completely. That's so cool. Doesn't do like millions of damage, but it's still enough to kill them. One shot. And here we have the boss, okay. Usually I would use things on cooldown, but I just wanted to show you oh, how much damage this is. Look how much damage. Crazy! And thank you. All right. Check you next time.